Good afternoon and welcome to today's blog. We are in week 8 of the college football season and what a great week we are expecting to have. Here are a few matches to watch this week, beginning with tonight's game between Oregon and UCLA. Oregon has one of the top offenses in the country, leading the nation in points per game. Even though UCLA won a big game against Texas a couple of weeks earlier at Austin, they have failed to perform well against some of the top teams of the Pac-10. This is an easy choice. I'm going with Oregon's Quack Attack. The next game to watch is the LSU Bayou Tigers against the Auburn Tigers. You ever had a sweet feel of revenge after losing the game the year before, then coming back the following year? Well, this is what's going to happen for the Auburn Tigers. Last season, LSU crushed Auburn 31-10, but Auburn did not have quarterback Cam Newton under center. The Heisman frontrunner is one of the best all-around athletes of the country. The 6'6", 250-pound quarterback has the size of a linebacker and the speed of a receiver. Look for a close match with Auburn coming out on top. Another match to watch this week is the Wisconsin Badgers against the Iowa Hawkeyes. The question I have in mind is, what Badger team will we see this week? The team that beat Ohio State last week, the number one team, or a different team? This week they are going to Iowa, and Iowa has a better defense. I think I, the Hawkeyes should win this game because they have a better offense, led by quarterback Ricky Stanzi. It should be a close game, but Iowa should come out on top. The next game to watch is the Nebraska Cornhuskers against the Oklahoma State Cowboys. The key matchup to, for this game is the Oklahoma State receivers against the Nebraska secondary. Look out for Justin Blackman to have a big game, but not enough for Nebraska to beat Nebraska. Nebraska has a better team, and they should come back from following a loss to Texas last week. So I'm going with Nebraska. I don't For this week, I don't have a big upset, but I do have a team who who is an upset alert, and that is the Arizona Wildcats, who is, facing the, who is facing the Washington Huskies. Washington had a big game last week, coming up with an upset overtime thriller over Oregon State, and what a game it was. Jake Locker improved a lot this season, and it looks like Coach Steve Sarkeesian's offense is starting to have a rhythm. Look out, Wildcats, because Washington is a tough team. And here we are, the game of the week. Number one Oklahoma against number one Missouri, number eleven Missouri. I think Oklahoma should win. Why? Because they have a better balanced offense. They can not only hurt you running the ball, but throwing the ball. All the Oklahoma Sooners, the only thing the Oklahoma, the only thing the Oklahoma defense has to do is just to cover the Missouri Tigers receivers. That's all they have to do. If they can, if they keep on um, Lane Gabbard the quarterback for Missouri in containment, they should win the game. Thank you for watching today's blog. I'm Akeem McCall. Be easy.